Hi, welcome to the Old Geezer's Diary on Monday, Bank Holiday Monday, the 6th of May, 2024. Wow, a couple of busy days. Yesterday went all completely wonky because instead of uh, going out in the afternoon, <laughs> instead of going out in the afternoon, I sat about on my sister's decking, drinking Guinness, which was lovely, her partner Frank's Guinness. <laughs> he didn't enjoy me drinking it, but I enjoyed it. And uh, then today I've been working this most of this morning and things on the uh, on ships and shipping on a couple of videos for ships and shipping my YouTube channel that's really getting busy, uh, which is really fun and good to do. So what else have I got to tell you? Well, I'm going to talk about a couple of things today, and one that really annoyed me when I bought it. But having said that, there you go. I bought some slightly cheap, um, not really a brand, but other brand salt at. Uh, Morrison's a few weeks ago and I usually buy Saxa salt because it's always you know fine no problem but this was about half the price so I bought some and it's the most awful muck you can buy it's damp and horrible uh, and I've actually asked on Facebook how to kind of dry it out and someone's told me so I'm going to do that a little bit later today we'll see how that one goes but um that is an interesting one I'll let you know what happens to that by the way this is a salt packet if you see this in Morrison's, I wouldn't buy it because I think it's it's just fiddling about. Someone's told me that I should put it in the oven and dry it. And I'll try doing that. I'll give it a crack and see what happens. But generally speaking, not a good idea. So that's one thing. Um, there was something else I was going to talk to you about just briefly, which is politics. I get involved in my head with politics. I don't know about you. I think a lot of us do. I think what I'd like to say is that all of the politicians we've got now, they're such a nasty lot. They're nasty to each other all the time. That Suella Braverman, Braverman, Suella, whatever her name is, she um, she was going on about all the Labour Party being rabid lefties, whereas she can't really talk, can she? Because she's a Conservative. And the Conservatives, following the line of Boris Johnson, tell lies, Rhys Mogg, multi-millionaire who doesn't give a shit about anybody um, and all the other mob they're all they're all kind of backstabbers the, the, the Tories in Parliament I'm not saying the guys in the street who may vote Conservative the guys in Parliament tell lies all the time they do crooked things and they are themselves heavily into crookedness and I don't believe any of them I think they've screwed our country <laughs> Over the past few years, they've screwed our NHS and they're still screwing our NHS. What we should do is vote them out and give someone else a go. I don't care if they're the Greens. I don't care if they're Labour. But it's just as long as they're not conservative. Because that's just, in my vocabulary these days, another word for crook. OK, I'm Chris. This is the Old Geezer's Diary. I hope you vote for someone other than conservative at the next general election, which is going to be coming up soon. See you soon.